everybody welcome to code pros channel i will to do a product review on a brand new rod i just picked up this is the quantum energy uh rod i picked it up for a little less than 175 dollars it's new for 2011 it is super super light i swear go out to a lake or something pick up about i won't say 10 feathers off of a goose that's laying on the dirt and i swear that's how much this rod weighs uh, the rod weighs um, I got it suited with the uh, best reel I got, and that's my Quantum Tour Edition. Um, it's a Tour Edition PT. Um, it's got 11, or it's actually got 12 stainless steel ball, hybrid ball bearings. Uh, Quantum is the best reel or rod on the market today, I promise you. Oh, and also, they just released, let's uh, I say four hours ago, um, a new quantum reel and rod, spinner reel and bait caster called the EXO. It's an exoskeleton. It is the baddest reel on the market right now. Um, I hadn't had a chance to get my hands on one yet because they just released them. Uh, they're $250 a piece, but they're super. They're awesome. So go to quantumfishing.com and check them out. Um, but I want to take my reel off the rod and kind of show you the rod. This rod has micro guides on it. Fuji. It's got a Fuji reel seat. And I got line tangled up here. So hold on. Alright. It's got Fuji reel seat. And if you ask me what a reel seat is, this is the reel seat. Um, it's broke right here. There's no cork. I love that feature. It's light, light weight, I swear. Um, ultra good action. You can feel anything with it. It's sensitive as can be. But it's got micro guides on it. Um, micro guides, and uh, which are smaller guides. So you can get out there and throw further. It keeps your line closer together through running through the eyes so it's more accurate and that's what that's a key thing in a rod this one is a six and a half foot um it is a super awesome rod this is the quantum energy 2011 rod it's blue and it says it's right there quantum energy well it says energy but 54 million strand graphite rod, medium heavy action. Awesome. And if you ever want to do a test to so show how sensitive a reel or a rod is, get a partner to hold the butt end of the rod and stick it up to your throat like so and go, mmm. And you can tell how sensitive your rod is. Just hum. Put it up to your throat and hum into it. And you can tell how sensitive the rod is. Um, I appreciate you tuning in to Code Pro's channel. This is Cody Strickland here. I'm signing off. Everybody be safe and be careful out there. I love everybody. Thanks for tuning in. Subscribe, please.